Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So finally, Universal ABX Day is there upon us, right? So yeah, we are going to check out Thena and Scarlet Witch in ABX and see if Thena is worth building for ABX, right? So let's go ahead and check out her stats. So as you can see in terms of her build, with her own leadership, she has 61,000 physical attack. And apart from that, rest of all her stats are pretty much maxed out. In terms of her gear, she is equipped with um, massive, right? <laughs> Six star physical attack rules along with 12, I repeat, 12 warnings blessings, right? All her relevant skills are maxed out. Her type enhancement rank 5. Her ISO 8 is stage 12 Hawks Eye. Her artifact is 3 star. She is rocking a CDP of 8. Yeah, I felt the pain of uh, using 800 crystal to remove her mighty CDP of destruction and her uniform is legendary right so yeah and in terms of his skill rotation for abx right now i'd suggest however it could be better right so it's two cancel into three cancel into four cancel into five and try to proc on five as simple as that and as soon as she swings use the one skill right so on fifth skill when you see her swinging like this one two three yeah right at this time you use the first skill yeah, and then again, once for tier 3, right, you need to do 2, cancel 3, cancel 4, insta cancel 5, or maybe just a delete cancel and you proc on 6, as simple as that. Uh, however, using a CTP of energy or CTP of destruction is a bit difficult in ABX considering that there are so many mobs around, so it is very highly likely that uh, you will miss proc you will miss most of your procs right yeah i have tried doing that and yeah more often than not i have actually missed my proc quite a few times right so yeah that's it right so let's go ahead and check out her competitor right and she is none other than scarlet witch right so with her own leadership as you can see her energy attack is sixty-nine thousand, right and that is because as you can see on my card where is this sorry I have higher energy attack, right? So almost like 129% um, to, and I have just around like 114% uh, physical attack, right? So there is a bit of uh, difference in terms of uh, uh, attacks on the card. However, it's pretty much similar for everyone, right? Because almost everyone has higher energy attack so anyways let's check our build so her energy attack as i said is 69,000 rest of all her stats are maxed out now the most important thing boys right she has right only one two three four five five odin's blessings right or is it four sorry one two three four just four Odin's blessings apart from that all her relevant skills are maxed out type enhancement four stage 12 overdrive <laughs> just some weird artifact and uh, yeah ctp of rage and her uniform is at mythic rock and in terms of skill rotation right as you can see you will start with one cancel into five cancel into two cancel four then proc on using a CTP of rage right and as soon as that's done one cancel four cancel into five then again proc on five and next rotation is going to be the tier three rotation for that we are going to use one cancel into five let her land for tier three cancel two four then three as uh, simple as that right yeah so yeah, so that's the skill rotation for both Athena and right our baby girl Scarlet Witch. So boys and girls do keep it in mind that Scarlet Witch actually has eight, I repeat, eight late Odin's blessings, right? So just wonder what she would do if she actually had eight more Odin's blessings, right? So whatever score which we are going to see is because Wanda has less Odin's blessing compared to Athena, right? So anyways should you actually keep a uh, thena for world boss legend or should you equip her with rage especially for ctp uh, for abx right 
So let's go ahead and figure that out together, right? So boys and girls, without wasting much of your time, let's go ahead and do the comparison. I need you right now. Yeah, I need you right now. 